Welcome back, Dana Club. We did it. We survived the impossible. Drove back a friggin' alien invasion. And we did it together. As heroes. The Spider-Man led the way, and every day New Yorkers rose to the challenge. Today I am so pleased to talk with one of those heroes. Author, journalist, and avid motorcyclist. Please welcome Mary Jane Watson. Thanks, Danica. Please call me MJ. MJ it is. So, I ate up your book about Simcaria in a single sitting. Thank you for giving this to the world. It's so important. I heard we're going to get even more of your words in the form of a new project. Can you tell us more about it? Happy to. I've been thinking a lot about what's really important. Nothing will make you rethink your life like a citywide alien invasion, right? Relatable. And I realized how important the truth is. I started a podcast called The New Normal. I don't know where New York is headed, but I'm looking forward to finding out. With all of you out there, I want to be honest and report what's really happening in the city. Straight up. No exaggerations, no clickbait, you know? I know exactly what you mean. When you let that... <laughs> oh, we're getting by. Would you like to join us? Howard, you and the pigeons okay? <laughs> of course. How can I help? Sometimes I just sit here. Take it all in. Fairies coming here. See it? There it is. You and the birds taking a trip? Think I'll skip this one. Wait for the next. Used to love the ferry. Felt like I was sailing off on an adventure. Howard? See that yellow skipper? With the black bottom? And that ride's got style. Honey of a boat. Wish I could take that bumblebee out for a spin. Hey, Howard. Ride it all the way across the river to those three pillars. An ancient city hidden in the clouds. Ancient city? You lost me, Howard. Over to the right. Look for the red lights. I see them. Three smokestacks. But why? I worked in that factory for 20 years. Laid off. Lost my purpose for a while. And then when my wife passed, Lost my heart to but my birds. They taught me how to fly again. Especially little Pidgey. Howard, I'm here for you. Last one. Can you spot Lady Liberty herself? She's way over to the left. That's her, all right. What? Huh. That's the flock. I need your help, Spider-Man. I'm finally going on an adventure. But I want to set my birds free first. Let them see the world outside this city. NYC is the best place in the world for pigeons, Can you though. take them up north for me? Somewhere peaceful? But they need you, Howard. It's their time. Try a whistle. You got it, Howard. Let's fly! Let's stay by the water. I'll think of a spot soon. Battery Park! You can poop on anything and anyone there. Nothing you all haven't seen before, though. We'll keep going. Get a nice view on top of the Brooklyn Bridge.
this isn't the right home for y'all. That sea breeze looks strong. Let's pick up some speed. woo -hoo! Hey, Pidgey, hit us with a barrel roll. Yeah, buddy. What about the woods near Queens? Mom took me there all the time back in the day. It was like a hidden oasis. Sounds like a good place to be a bird. Oh, wow, a regatta. Howard would love that. Don't worry, birds. We're almost at your new home. Y'all feeling our web wings? <laughs> Thanks for the inspiration. I'm gonna miss chasing you birds all over New York. Find a place for my babies to be free? Thought of a place over in Queens. Mama showed it to me when I was little. Lots of nature and space for Pidgey and friends. That sounds nice. Thanks. Not many folks have been kind to me in my life. Anytime, Howard. It's a new borough, but it's still close enough for you to visit. I'll get this bird settled and be right back. Howard? Hope y'all like the new digs. Well, that was a workout. Whew. I'll catch the next train. Gotta make sure Howard's okay. Can't be easy when the birds leave the nest. Oh. Howard? Looks like natural causes. <laughs> oh, hey, Spider-Man. Sorry. Howard was a friend. Take all the time you need. If it helps, um... It looked like he was at peace. It does. He's on a new adventure now. And his wife's with him. Don't worry, Howard. The flock is free. <laughs> Smell the change in the air. It's fresh and clean. A new day for this world. Staring down the face of the apocalypse. offers a new perspective on life. Time to let go of old grievances. Rearrange priorities. While the world waited with bated breath to see if they would be next. New York stood tall and held the line. We did not acquiesce after we take a moment to celebrate the freedom we fought so hard to retain. We must then turn our sights to the people responsible for putting us in harm's way to begin with. I'm talking about Oscorp and the spider. 
You're going to hear a lot of conflicting reports and lies surrounding the events of last week. But let me... You know, for a place where everyone's comfortable calling out when something's wrong, people here sure hate admitting when they're wrong. The writer in me does love the irony. Meadow brought to a halt. You love to see it. 